What is going on my giggity giggity gamers? Welcome back to another banger Elden Ring video. I have an amazing video lined up for you guys today. I have the first ever Helling Tree Ruin farm. It is amazing and you could take out an Erd Tree avatar with it. First and foremost, I want to thank all the members of my channel and all the subscribers. Thank you guys for your support. It means the world to me. Without further ado, let's get into this video. So, you need five weapons and these are the weapons right here so if you do not know where to get the this weapon and the ash of war and this weapon and the ash of war and then these three weapons please go check my last video because i'm going to explain this really fast so this isn't a long video for you guys so the dagger and longsword you can get from the twin maidens at the round table hold spinning weapon you can get from rajir he will be at the round table hold when you beat godric for ground slam or golden slam it is going to be right here in limgrave all you got to do is defeat a uh teardrop scarab once you have both ash of wars and both these weapons you need the uchi katana america's hammer and devourer scepter america's hammer is obviously if somebody has to drop it for you or you have beat the game so this is a new game plus ruin farm for the uchi katana and devourer scepter it is going to be right here. The Uchi Katana is going to be right here in the Death Touch Catacombs. Or you can start with Samurai. If you don't know where to go, leave a comment below or join the Discord. For Devourer Scepter, at the start of your run, all you got to do is kill the NPC that is standing at Warmaster Shack. And he will drop it to you. So, that is everything that you need. So, for the first part of this glitch, you need to do the regular move swap that makes you float in the air. So you need to do Uchi Katana in the left hand, America's Hammer in the right hand, and then you are going to drink an empty flask. So you need to empty your Wondrous Physics, drink it in the middle, click your Ash of War, and then switch out the Uchi Katana for the Devourer's Scepter. That is what it will look like if done correctly. Then once we get to the spot we're going, we are going to do this move swap where you do not need torrent so you need the dagger in the right hand and the long sword in your left hand double hand or not the long sword in your left hand the uchi katana in your left hand and the dagger in your right hand drink your empty flask ash of war go up one switch to the spinning weapon and then once you're backed out of all of the menu you need to hold your ash of war button and if done correctly it will look like this so those are the two move swaps that you need to do. If you need me to go more in depth, I do go more in depth in the last video. So feel free to go to that video and it will walk you through it slower. So now what you're going to do is you're going to come to the drainage channel site of grace in the helic tree. You're going to go directly this way where I do and you're just going to jump up here and then fall down to this once you are right here you're just going to come directly this way and stand directly right here once you are right here this is where we are going to do the move swap drink your empty flask ash of war down to one if that happens right there just quit out of your game and reopen it so i'm going to cut to where i'm back in that area so as you can see, I'm back up on the ledge because I quit out before I hit the ground. So this, like I said, is where you're going to do the move swap. Drink your empty flask, Ash of War, switch to Devourer Scepter, and run forward. You're going to want to look down because you are landing right here. If you go too far, you will land down there and you will die. But once you land right here, all you need to do is walk forward and drop right here. Once you are right here, this is where we are going to do the other move swap. So dagger in your main hand and Uchi Katana in your off hand. Double hand the Uchi Katana and do the move swap again. So drink, Ash of War, go up, switch to spinning weapon. If this happens right here, just quit out. I wanted to show you guys a failed drop. This way you guys know exactly what to do. If you don't quit out fast enough, you just have to restart the glitch. But once you load back in, you will be back up on that platform, and all you need to do is attempt the glitch. Do not start walking forward until you are floating in the air. So, again, 
You are going to put the Uchi Katana in your left hand, double hand the Uchi Katana, drink your empty flask, Ash of War, go up to spinning weapon, back all the way out, hold your Ash of War button. You are going to continue falling until the ruins pop up. All you have to do is keep holding your Ash of War button. So you're going to fall for about a minute to a minute and a half. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward until I get the ruins. So as you can see, the ruins did pop up and I got about 230,000 ruins. You can fall a little bit longer to get a little bit more ruins. But I am on New Game Plus One. If you're not on New Game Plus One, you'll get about 180,000 to 200,000. But once you have gotten your ruins, you're just going to let go of your Ash of War. It will pop up with the You Died screen, and you just need to redo the glitch. So I'm going to fast forward me doing the glitch to where I can show you where you're going to pick up your ruins. And then what you need to do once you do pick them up. So as you can see, your ruins are right here. Once you pick them up, all you got to do is go back to the training channel and you have completed this ruin farm. It's a super easy ruin farm if you're used to doing the move swap. If you're not used to doing the move swap, it's not going to be an easy ruin farm. But it is fun to do. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that subscribe button. Over 90% of you guys that watch my videos are not subscribed. It is free and you can always change your mind. Without further ado, I'll catch you guys in the next video. As always, stay crazy and I love y'all support. Peace.